Cole Golden was leaving for work Thursday morning when he noticed glass all over the driveway. A quick look inside and he realized thieves took several items, but a simple piece of plastic is what led him to the suspects. I had a pistol in my truck and so that's what I felt most bad about was my gun was in there. Quickly realizing his pistol was gone along with his wallet and inside his credit cards. My wallet was Credit cards, driver's license, everything was in that. So he did what most people would do, call the bank to cancel those cards, but going a step further. We immediately got on the phone with the bank. We got with uh, Wells Fargo and we let them know, hey, our vehicle or our cards have been taken. So we checked the last few transactions. The suspected thieves had used it to try and get some rest. We noticed that someone had used it to purchase a hotel room at uh, a Connell Lodge here in Loving. So he hopped in his car and went over there and asked the motel employee if someone had used his card. Sure enough, the clerk said yes. So Golden called police. Officers arrived five minutes later, knocking on the door of the suspect's room. Golden says he saw the suspects jump out of the window and run. It wasn't long before police caught up with Derek Foreman and Jesse Garcia, both men taken into custody for outstanding warrants, while police continue to look into their involvement in Golden's case. At least one good thing came out of it. They were dumb enough to use my credit card. And none of Golden's items have been recovered yet. Shallow Water Police say they believe Foreman and Garcia sold the guns before they were taken into custody. They also are looking for a third suspect they say is involved in these crimes. Well, Nicolette, 